Okay, hi friends, welcome to my old room and I really feel like we're in a time capsule because my hair is brown again. Surprise. Uh, I dyed it back brown a couple days ago. My hair was just falling out and I couldn't do the bleach anymore. It's kind of red right now, but um, my hairdresser did it so when it fades, it doesn't become muddy, so it won't be this red. But I really like it back to brown. It's just back to normal. So today I'm going to do a little haul for you guys. It's not little. This is a giant haul. Um, I've been accumulating these things for a little over two months and I haven't shown them. I haven't shown most of them in a video yet and you'll see them in my winter like super cold outfits lookbook that's coming in a week or two weeks. So I figured I'd show them today and talk a little bit more about them and I like to get these things up so if you guys want these items um, you can get them because I feel bad a lot of the clothes I show in my outfits videos are old or thrifted so I can't really show them. Let's get started. First is this little workout um, long sleeve and it's from Maritzia. It was on sale like from 40 bucks to 20. They still have them, I'll link them below. Maritzia is having a crazy Black Friday sale right now and they're super soft. I've been going to bar class now and I didn't have any workout clothes because I hadn't worked out in like over a year so I had to buy new clothes and the long sleeves are really nice because bar isn't like cardio or anything I'm not trying to lose weight I'm trying to like gain muscle so you don't really get like that sweaty it's just I don't know I like to keep my muscles warm right from the beginning so I got it in gray and cream color and this one if you wear sports bra underneath you're fine like it doesn't see through they're pretty thin though so like you wear a sports bra underneath it's not like the Lulu ones that are like super tight and suck you in then another white long sleeve I messed up today. Normally when I do outfits videos or anything trying on clothes, I don't put on any face makeup or like blush or lipstick because I don't want to get it on my clothes. And today I just wasn't thinking. I'm so out of place here. So I got a ton of makeup on this shirt. But it's so cute. It's from H&M and it was super inexpensive. And it's got this like boning underneath the boob. I think it looks so expensive when it's not. I would say size up though. I got an extra small. And I wish I got a small because then it wouldn't have stretched so much and looked see-through. So, yeah, size up and then it shouldn't look see-through. It's just when you pull it so tight how things work. I wasn't thinking. <laughs> oh, I'm not going in any order, I guess. Another thing from Maritzia, though, is just this white little t-shirt. It's just uh, Wilfred is the brand. It's an extra, extra small. Um, it's a perfect little white t-shirt. It's like nice and thick and nice quality. Another thing that was on sale from Maritzia that I got makeup on is this TNA long sleeve um, kind of thermal ribbed shirt and it's just super comfy. I didn't realize like I needed a white long sleeve in my closet because I wear this and whenever it's clean I'm wearing it with blue jeans and like cute pair of booties. You're perfect like for dinner, going out to the bar, like just great little outfit. Then from Maritzia I got I never would buy the boyfriend sweatshirt because I was like, that is so expensive, that's so stupid. And then I bought the $80 sweatshirt. I live in this thing. I already asked my brother for the gray one for Christmas because I'm so obsessed with it. Um, I got it in this really pretty oatmeal color. And then of course, I got the matching pants that I'm wearing right now. Um, you'll see it better in the try on. They're just joggers, boyfriends. The cut is so perfect. I got these ones in a size two and the joggers in a small. Um, I should have got the joggers in extra small because I don't have a booty to fill out the back. <laughs> so they look saggy butt if I don't wash them like after each wear. Another cream from Aritzia, which I love this with that set. I just look like a giant marshmallow. I got the super long super puff. It's just the long super puff. Two years ago, I got the regular super puff in black. It's the warmest jacket I've ever owned. My parents got me this giant Eddie Bauer jacket for when I went to college like walking to class it was gonna be really cold and I was always still freezing in that jacket and then I think for Christmas and my birthday I got the super puff two years ago or a year ago so warm and then I was like well if the cropped one it's not cropped it's the normal one is warm the long one will just be insane and I'm so sick of black um, jackets so I got the cream one it gets a little dirty, but it's really easy to wash. Um, the only reason I get it dirty is because I go to the dog park with Ernie in this, and he is a mess. So, yeah, but 
I am obsessed with this jacket. I get so many compliments on it. People are like, you look like a walking sleeping bag. And I like that, that's a compliment. Another jacket I got, because I think you guys know I'm jacket obsessed, is from Urban. And it's this faux leather and Sherpa one. It's actually a chocolate brown shiny color. And this one too, I get so many compliments on it. Every time I wear it, it's a little cropped one. You'll see better in the try on again. I don't remember how much it is originally, but I got it for 50 bucks and it was like over half off on sale. And all my jackets are really oversized and I've been liking the oversized pants. So sometimes when I do oversized pants and an oversized jacket, I wish more of my figure was showing or like, I don't know, you know what I mean? So I'm really happy I have this cropped one and yeah, it's super cute. Then this jacket, <sighs> I came home, well I am home for Thanksgiving break and I this jacket was still in the mail, the urban one, and I didn't have a jacket to wear to the bar uh, like the day before Thanksgiving and I was like, I hate all my outfits, I have nothing. I don't bring that much home when I come here so everything's at school. And my mom was like, oh, let's look in Pop's, my dad's closet and I was gonna see if he had like a blazer I could wear and like make that work. And then she pulls this out of the back and I was like, why have you never told me that this exists? And my mom was like, oh my god, your dad's gonna love it if you wear it. So of course I wore it and I'm taking it now. My dad has worn it in like 10 years, he said. But it's this leather Vanson jacket and um, everybody was asking me if my dad was a NASCAR driver. Um, this is motorcycles, so. Yeah, I didn't know that at the time either, but I told my dad that and he was like, well, they're dumb. Like, this is a motorcycle jacket. I was like, oh, good. But it's this really thick leather jacket. It's real leather, so it's so warm and so heavy. And I think I've said this before, I'm totally okay with vintage leather. Um, it's honestly, I think, better than any kind of fast fashion. So yeah, I'm just, oh my God, I'm obsessed with this jacket and this is all I'm gonna be wearing now. And the NASCAR one I have, the Jeff Gordon, isn't that warm, but I can layer a lot underneath. But this one, just with the t-shirt underneath, we had to wait in line for almost two hours to get into the bar. And it was probably like 30 degrees outside. And then I was wearing this, I was fine. I'm obsessed. It's so oversized, but I like that look. Oh my god, you guys. I didn't realize I had this much to show. Now I'm kind of concerned. I got my first designer thing. <laughs> They're these Gucci sunglasses. And it's this beautiful tortoise shell. They're in the most amazing shape I've ever seen in my entire life. Like, I've been looking for these glasses. And I found them on Depop. I wasn't looking for a Gucci pair. I was looking for a pair with like this shape. And I found this pair on Depop and they were Gucci and they were a hundred bucks and I was like, give me those. It's less expensive than like Ray-Bans. Um, I could easily justify this pair of sunglasses. So yeah, these are my first designer piece. <laughs> I don't know why I thought that was kind of fun and like a monumental moment. I'm not someone who's big into designer though, so I don't think I would ever buy like new designer. I love vintage designer though, that's so, I don't know, it makes it more special. Anything vintage I think is just way more special. That jacket's so much more special to me than any jacket, these sunglasses. Rant over. Next, I got these perfect little like cowboy western looking boots off ASOS. Um, I know they're sold out, so I'll link a similar pair down below, but they're super comfortable. The heel's not like too high where you feel crazy, and they go really nice and high up the ankle. The only thing is, Ernie got them one night when I left home, home alone, and he chewed a hole in there, and this part fell off, so there's no traction now on this foot, so I slide everywhere when I wear these. Um, I'm still gonna wear them, but I ordered a new pair of black boots that look, they're not exactly the same because again, they're sold out, but they're pretty similar. Um, just cause Ernie ruined these, which is really upsetting cause they're not cheap, but I'm still gonna wear them. I'd like, if I wear black socks underneath, you can't tell and I just can't drink too much if I wear them because I'll slide everywhere. And then the next pair of shoes I got are these little Nikes little. I don't know why I said that. I don't know what these are called. But everybody's been making fun of me for them. They said they're really ugly. They look like runner shoes. And I do think they're more of a summer shoe. They were on sale for 50 bucks. So I wanted, oh, they're P6000s. 
I wanted them now. They come in a bunch of different colors. These ones are orange and pink. But I think a pair of like baggy jeans and like a little white t-shirt in the summer. Like, And these are so cute. I was totally inspired by this girl I follow on Instagram. Her name's like Anna or Anna. She has these and I thought she looked so cute. And so I got them and now I'm getting roasted for buying them. <laughs> Um, the only one who likes them is my brother, so at least he likes them. Then the last two things I got are actually these earrings from Adina's Jewels. If you guys know, I had a thick pair of hoops that looked just like this. They were from Urban though, and they came in a little three pack, and I think they were 20 bucks for a three pack. And then these were $60, and they don't tarnish. My ones from Urban, all three of them broke, all three sizes. So I was like, you know what, for 60 bucks, I'll just get a nicer pair of like thick hoops. Um, they're still super light. They have a bit size bigger than this on their website and a size smaller. They're having like a 35% off sale right now, so check it out. Um, not sponsored. This, none of this in this video is sponsored. And then also, just because um, they're having a sale, I also got this little chain ring in the middle, so it like bends and moves so all around. Um, it looks a lot like this one that I have from Mahiri, the thick one, and now I have a thin one. Um, if you guys want to shop Mahiri, they're having a sale right now too, and I'll put my link down below. It gives me a little commission if you use my link, and that really helps me do these hauls for you guys. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you like these kind of videos to show you the clothes uh, in a little more detail before I do an outfits video, or if you find it boring because you see it in an outfits video, let me know that too. You don't always get to see like workout clothes and stuff like that though, so I thought it might be a little fun. Well, I love you guys so much. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you want to. See you next Sunday.